Hey folks, welcome back. It's Veterans Day, so happy Veterans Day to those that served. Thank you very much for that service. It's greatly appreciated. Uh, yeah, what you see here, I went to Walmart and had uh, one of my pictures turned into a, a wall hanging there. And uh, what I'm going to do, I'm fixing to start another project. And I've got... Uh, four scraps of uh, fence picket there i'm going to cut the points off of and then i'm going to uh, glue them together and then attach that uh, photograph that you saw after that i'll drill a hole and i'm going to mount the uh the uh projectile that was removed from the uh the second deer and i've got the primer cap i kept and i'm gonna put that on this plaque as well and then i'm going to get a hold of uh my brother's pastor and uh see if he can uh do a uh little engrave a little plaque that i can put on it um uh, saying something like uh, two deer with one shot and then the uh the date that i did that it's just kind of this my personal opinion um i think it's just uh too cool of a thing to just kind of not have anything to put on the wall or something i don't know being too uh too dough like that um you know what do you got hey anyhow uh, other than a freezer full but that's what i'm gonna do today um of course the job that i have we're off today so it, which is cool but again i want to thank those veterans and we'll get this project started and i will bring you back when i get some progress made so stay tuned Okay, this is how it's going to lay out. I got them all cut up. I just got to get the, uh, got to get it glued together and then uh, set the photo on it. And then it, I guess here and here is where I'll, I'll drill out for the, uh, the uh, expanded projectile. And then I'll put the, uh, the little uh, percussion cap there. And then down across this bottom, I'm going to have a plaque done. Or, a, yeah, I guess that's what it is. Or, a uh, little nameplate or something and and uh, attach it there at the very bottom and then hang it on the wall okay I'm gonna get a somehow I'm gonna get a uh, little workbench set up so I can start gluing these little pieces together so all right if you're uh, wanting to check it out stay with me Okay, just a kind of a quick update. There is the uh, mushroomed projectile that uh, I shot the two deer with, and that is the primer cap. I took it out. Uh, I, I, hang, I hung on to it. Now I've got it uh, in there, and uh, I may have to put a little little bit of glue in there. That one there is in there pretty tight. And then I'm fixing to put that photograph on it. I don't. I thought about putting some rope around it and stuff, and I thought, nah, I don't need to get too carried away with the uh, with the rope. Of course, I, I don't know. It might it might be all right to use around the photograph itself. I'll, I'll have to see. But anyway, I'm gonna get the photograph, and I think what I'm gonna do is utilize them two holes right there and put a screw through, because that's pretty thick. Uh, uh, block that she used to put that picture on so anyway I'll get that done and, and uh, I'll bring you back as soon as I uh, get the picture installed all right stay tuned okay good morning folks I've got the uh, picture glued down to the pickets and uh, I'm debating on whether or not <clears throat> to put some sort of either rope or maybe 
if I have any cedar edging left over, I might do that. I, just, I don't know. I'm just thinking maybe, maybe uh, it needs to be bordered. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. I might kick it around and show it to a few friends of mine online and see what they think. All right. I'm going to get back to work on this. And as soon as I get it, I still need to uh, get in touch with the, my brother's pastor to see if I can get a deal made for that. Anyway, I will be back shortly, so stay tuned. All right, I've been working on this uh, rope. Started it there in the center and bringing it around, you know, complete the loop. But uh, I, I burned it, obviously. For obvious reasons, I burned it before <laughs> gluing it to the uh, the edges of that photograph because I sure don't want to burn my picture up. Anyway, and uh, that's where we're at now. I'm fixing to uh, continue uh, going around the uh, around the corner with it, and uh, and then I've got to. I'm going to go online if. Uh, my brother's pastor is not able to. I'll go online, maybe find a trophy company and see if they, you know, if they'll do just one little plaque. A lot of times they don't want to mess with that kind of stuff. But we'll see. Okay. Stay tuned. Okay, guys. I got the, uh, the rope booter done around that... Uh, picture i like this it it, it does kind of help break up because it did uh, i was talking to a friend of mine and she said it looked camouflaged without that without some sort of of border but nothing you know nothing great big because you still you know you don't want to take away from uh the photograph but uh, anyway we got the we got it broken up a little bit where you can tell, or you know, yeah, you know what I mean. I'm not into that stuff, but now I just got to uh, get that plaque done. It'll go right here, and then uh, this will be officially finished, but I can go ahead and at least hang it on the wall while I'm waiting. So I may end this video here. Um, I don't know. It just depends on how long it'll take to get that uh, plaque done. But I may go ahead and release the video and get it up so y'all can see it. Anyway, uh, whether I do or not, if you like what you see, give it a thumbs up, share it, and uh, subscribe to the channel. Take care.